there is almost nothing that I won't try in my personal life to get a great song. <laughs> What's up, music lovers? My name is Kev Bro. I'm a working singer-songwriter, and this is a series I'm doing called How to Write Great Songs. So, one thing that I found is that great songs are selfless. So, be selfless. And you can look at, at this idea on both a macro and a micro level. On a macro level, well, let's start micro first. While, while I'm writing a song, I try to put away all of my opinions, beliefs, values, morals, and live in the context of, while, of the song while I'm writing it. So while I'm singing it, while I'm thinking about it in the shower, while I'm driving, while I'm humming, while I'm listening to mixes, while I'm watching other people listen to it. I try not to judge it in any way based on what I think. I know it's very hard to do, but I try to keep this selfless um, attitude to it. It's not about me, it's about the song, that living, breathing organism. And whatever angle I can take on that song, I'm making it a great song, if it needs to be a great song and wants to, then I will take that road. That's the micro level. On a macro level, there is almost nothing that I won't try in my personal life to get a great song. <laughs> For better or worse. Um, there's almost nothing it means more than to me than having great material and enjoying great music in my life. So, my personal life is built around um, getting great songs. Now, is that selfless or selfish? Depends on who you ask. <laughs> I think it's selfless. I've given my life basically to a craft, no different than a priest or a doctor or a fireman. Um, you know, that where the lines are drawn between your personal life and your professional life and your artistic life, that's for someone else to decide. I just live life how I enjoy it, and I try to be selfless in accessing my material. So some of the ways that I do that are, I don't think in terms of genre, musical genre, or musical direction. I just play what feels good and sounds fun. And then when it comes to pre-production and produ producing things in the studio, then I can start making uh, arrangement decisions and, and instrument decisions and application decisions and things like that. But while I'm writing, I'm not thinking, I try not to think this will be a good this song. As soon as you get into this will be a good this song, I've found that I start to hurt the song itself because I'm thinking how I can practically apply it before the song has actually arrived or in full baby form. Uh, so be selfless with your material. You got to give everything. It's part of the deal. And uh, the rewards will are never ending. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to my channel here on YouTube, and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye-bye.